your, your fight background? Well, I trained in uh, Queens at a, at a place called the Lost Battalion Hall. It was uh, a gym in uh, Queens Boulevard. You had some famous fighters there. I did a radio show with Jerry Cooney, where everybody knows who Jerry Cooney is. He trained at that gym. Uh, Albert Ruggiano, his father was, uh, Fat Andy Ruggiano was a boss of the Gambino family at one time. His uh, brother, Anthony Ruggiano. David Sears, who fought Michael Spinks. We were all in the same camp growing up. So, uh, you know, I've been around the, the boxing game since I'm a kid. Uh, I traveled around the world. I was fighting in Brazil. So people know I know my way around the ring, and I was involved with fighters like uh, Denny Brown in his camp, and, and Prince Badi, who's a very personal friend of mine. So, uh, you know, we're just gonna get back in shape and go right back to what we used to doing, and we'll take it in the ring, and we'll see. We'll stop the talking, and we're gonna stop the year of tweeting, and, uh, you know, these guys that like to type, but we'll do it with our hands mm -hmm. instead of our fingers. Let's get it busy, let's get going, let's go into the ring. And like I said, I can speak for Phil Baroni because I know him since he's a kid. Uh, I don't care what age he is, he's always ready to fight too. You don't duck anybody, fights everybody. And uh, he's happens to be a kid that was raised around me and in my house. So I know the guy intimately and I know that the guy's a legitimate tough guy in the ring and in the street. So, you know, the guy moved forward with his life in the right